Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I wanted to talk about Kiehl's. I think this is a brand that I didn't think that I would ever make a video out of it because I think if you guys look at it, like all the brands that I have done in this channel, all of them have been like very aesthetically pleasing, even like luxury ones or just like even like on the lower end. Uh, all of them have been like very cute, like for instance, um, like these ones, like the I do care ones. They're like super cute, um, but like this is, has been like in my channel. So I just thought because I, <laughs> I'm a member of Equinox and I got like a gift card and I used it for a Kiehl's product. I thought it was maybe it's a good idea to just like look at the ingredients and see what's inside these products and just get a hang of like what is is it actually worth the price. Because I think uh, when you think about it and comparing to the other prices that's in the market, it is definitely on the higher end. It is definitely considered a luxury skincare. But I think because I'm so used to most luxury skincare products having like a very, I don't know, like super aesthetically pleasing packaging and like the very like extra stuff like it's just so like over the top but kills when you think about it you know like look at this one it's like ultra cream it is very simple or like this chapstick super simple and i even have like their body products so this one is the shampoo the amino acid shampoo and there's also the bath and body shower so like these are super simple it almost looks like something you could buy from like a drugstore um which i think that's essentially like the vibe that they're giving it's just kind of like trying not too much but like still a lot like i don't know because i think they're also main concept is like they are like aesthetics like i mean the doctor approved and stuff which is technically they are not um even Hiram said that too like when you walk into their store which i i think been there once or twice even their sales associate they wear like this white coat like meaning like they're doctors <laughs> i mean like the doctors in quotes or like people who know stuff like they're just sales associates so they're not like certified or anything like that so i just thought like it would be interesting to just look at the ingredients and see this like the price point is it worth it? So I wanted to start with the chapstick because I use you know a lot of chapsticks. I have done so many videos like with lip balms and everything with Fresh Beauty to Laneige, which is Laneige so far is my most favorite product that I have ever tried. So this one uh, is just like in a like it's 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 not like a balm that like you would squeeze and put it with your hand. You can actually just use it like this. So I think. Like it's perfect for guys because most of the time they don't want to do anything and it's perfect for the go. And I think price point wise is like not too bad because I think it's like $13. Not too bad and I was also looking at it. I mean because most of the skincare, I mean lip balms, they just have butter, like different kinds of butter. And some of them have oils in it. So yeah, this one has like oil, like peppermint oil, paprika oil. One thing I was thinking, and I look at it, looking at it, which is like one of the top ones. I think it's like number one ingredient. It's squalane. If you guys don't know, squalane is actually made out of olives, extracted from I think olive olive drives. Yeah, so it's highly effective for like maintaining like skin moisture. I was looking at this too because we will talk about it later. But they also have squalane in the ultra facial cream as well. So, but generally. I just want to say this to everyone, and I think Hiram also mentioned this too. I didn't know about it. So there are some brands they also use like Squalane, uh, but you have to be very careful to make sure to see where this is coming from because like uh, Kiehl's is making it from olive, like it's driven from, from olive, but it's actually generally used to be, I guess, driven from the stomach of a shark or something so it's not necessarily sustainable or like good for the environment like or the animals wise so just putting it out there if you guys see any time like swallowing it's generally a like, super good product but you just have to make sure like how it is derived and what's it made of in terms of this i would give this one i don't know like maybe six it's just not like the super moisturizing, I would say. It literally feels like it's something you could get from a drugstore. Like price-wise, I'm like not mad about it, but at the same time, it's just like it's nothing special that I could say, oh my God, it's amazing. I wanna talk about the Ultra Facial Cream, so this one. 
So this one's actually pretty good, I have to say. Like, it's nothing like like all the ingredients that's inside of it. Like I was looking at it, like it has glycerin inside, it has squalane, which I mentioned this before. So it's all like hydrating um, ingredients. I'm trying to see what else is inside. And it's also fragrance free, so that's like perfect for that. It smells like, it has no smell, that's just perfect. And also it has apricot oil, and also high, like this is like very hydrating oil. So it really helps with your skin. This is just perfect for like water loss, like if you have dry skin, so it really helps with the moisturizing. I would say it's also like, it's not super thick either, so that's just perfect to apply and go use it. One thing I would say, this is something I realized it. Um, so this ingredients that it has in here, it's pretty much the same as like in the eye cream of Kiehl's. So I'm gonna show you guys like the eye cream in here too, and like you can look into the like ingredients and too. Literally one of the main ingredients, one thing I'm always saying it too, when you see the first three or two ingredients, that's the ones that has like the, a lot inside the product. Rest of them it's just kind of becomes like 1%, 5%, like very little. It literally has the same one, glycerin, uh, like aqua water, like squalane. So it literally has the same thing as this one. So if you're gonna use something from Kiehl's for your eyes, don't get that like wrinkle, whatever eye cream because it literally has the same ultra facial cream ingredients. Get the one with avocado, it's like avocado oil or something. I will put the picture right here. That one is better and probably I would say worth more the price. But if you're gonna use something for eye cream, honestly, I just feel like eye creams are so overrated. I will definitely make a video about like just eye creams in general, but I think just use moisturizer and also put a little bit in your eyes. So it'll be perfect. I don't wanna mention so much about like the body and hair as I'm like not super expertise in those areas. But from my experiences, like I would say it's actually pretty good products. But in terms of like the price range, and also like I feel like would I buy it again if I like didn't get it for free or like if I just like got it as a gift or whatever, I would definitely use it. I feel like in terms of to the size also, like it's pretty like decent. Like you can use it for quite a while. I just, like wouldn't say like there is anything special about it that's all like because this one like the shampoo has like coconut oil in it so that's like pretty good like for hair i would say but like in, in terms of the ingredients like i was looking at it i don't see anything that's like oh my god like so extra like that like it has also pretty one of them has actually has protein in it yeah okay so like the body cleanser it has a uh, plant protein so i guess that's pretty good for the hair like for body wise um but it has also grapefruit flavor but again grapefruit like you don't even smell it like at all it's not like fragrance or anything like that i wouldn't say anything super special about these two products either i just generally don't think that there's so like so much anything about special about the whole brand honestly heels i just think they have been around for so long which means like they're definitely doing something right but i think they are definitely targeting a specific people that like i probably don't think that like, i am in their target group at all one thing i would recommend and this is probably like a lot of people have recommended definitely try their ultra facial cream i think out of all the products that they have this is probably the best one all right guys so that was the video for today uh, i hope you guys like this i will definitely put my affiliate links down below so uh it would mean so much to me uh if you guys you know check them out like no pressure but it really helps to support my channel so i really appreciate it and i'll see you guys next week bye